Hello, I am Fjallsback and welcome to Stellaris. Right, our secret drone here that was... Oh, uh, we found an anomaly. Inexplicable orbital phenomenon play across the surface of this planet, clearly visible from space, you go and deal with that. Uh, you were lost in time and space, or whatever you call it, for a while, and you're now back. So where can I send you? Can you actually reach out here now? Nope. We need to punch our way through somebody. And uh, this is now within our borders. The other ship we had, we sent there. So I guess we can go here. All right. Construction complete. Research complete. Okay, you're missing stuff. Leader lifespan increases. Tile blockers, better farms, cheaper watermans. Empire thingy and monthly unity. There's a lot of time difference in these texts here. Take the better leaders, or more leaders rather. You are lacking some energy. Guess we can sort that out. Like so. Settings seem fine. These guys are dying off, so that's why you don't have a spaceport. Everyone else seems okay, except for you, maybe. Let's upgrade you with those three for now. And then the surface here, we have stuff we could do. We are actually building here, so that's why. Okay, okay. Sectors. Look at this planet here. Okay, these are all fine, and our people here. Two planets that will die, the other three will stay in our control. Actually, five planets that will die. Oh, I see. We see. So if we can find a habitability tech or something, that would be nice. Hey, warp drive three in four months. That might help our shrine ships to go back up and above these guys and jump through here somewhere. Column ship going here. Good, good, good. Okay. Light show. The science officer, Autonomous Drone 16, reports that the luminous waves cursing through the ice that has blanketed uh, the planet is of alien origin. Some ancient battle has deposited scattered wreckage of an alien fighter on the frozen planet, and only the exposed core of its main weapons remain intact. It seems this alien race used lasers fairly similar to the ones currently in use by the Korean fleets, and the uh, Fizzling innards periodically discharge low-powered lasers into the ice of the planet. The planet's harsh climate prevents the lasers from actually melting the ice, allowing the chilly matrix to act as a brilliant prism. Okay, he gains experience. Good for you. Right, fleet capacity is about half. We're still making energy with a fleet in port granted. So I guess we will just add to the fleet slowly but surely. Right here, upgrade this building. At least here. System survey complete. Right, energy is not your thing. Right, right. System survey done. Okay, you are not getting that way, you're not getting over here. Not getting any way over here, nor here. Jump across, you can. We have served all up over here though, right? Right. Surveyed here. No way to jump out here, nor in this way.
this is outside our borders so right you go and upgrade and then take it from there and one more month you will actually get a better warp drive granted you'll have to upgrade twice Research complete. but I should be fine warp drive is it is More power, neutron torpedoes, plasma accelerators, ion disruptors, or automatic exploration. Guess we're doing the automatic exploration now. Right, better than the warp drives here, so do that for you guys. Upgraded. Excellent. Complete. You survey all the way down here at the end of that particular arm. Construction complete. Alright, you still have mines to connect, like these guys here. Mining stations and research stations. Ships upgraded. Hydron, you are upgraded and can you actually get back out here? You cannot this way. Out here, nope. Can you do assist research then? Where's the ship? You cannot do assist research either, apparently. Apparently. Oh yes, you can. You could. Not sure if that's the right place to do so, but I can't be bothered to look anywhere else. Um, okay, construction done. This all seems fine then. Seismic disturbances. There have been many reports of unexplained seismic disturbances on the exterior drone chamber. Tremors can be felt across the moon and many of our settlements have suffered damage. While investigating the earthquakes, our scientists discovered a vast network of subterranean caverns. Okay, the deepest of these caverns are home to some kind of in indigenous civilization and that uh, they appear to be tunneling towards the surface. Ground vibrations from our settlements may have triggered this behavior, but we cannot be certain. There is no telling how these aliens will react when they spill out of their tunnels and encounter our colonists. Seismic situations. Okay. Subterranean civilization. I usually established communications, but this time around we will do a... Um, Preemptive strike, that's basically what we do. So go with that. Do we actually have any soldiers on the ground on my planet here? No, let's just add some just in case. We need to. It's down there, I see. We see. Special project complete. All right. Our efforts to destroy the subterranean aliens on exterior drone chamber have met with success. We managed to collapse several of their tunnels on top of their workers, and the caverns that housed their citizens have been flooded with nerve gas. Uh, casualty projections are close to 100% and our security forces are confident that they will be able to deal with any surviving stragglers. Alright, the compliment to the guys involved. Okay, what do we build for you? Energy is still not a thing, right? Right, so nothing really. 
Yeah, you are still unhappy, but you are being eaten, so that should sort itself out soon enough. Um, habitability is still poor, right? For us, yeah. Research complete. Okay, got a new tech. More leaders, alright. Look into that shortly. Let's see what we'll do next. Naval capacity is not really what we need. Military Academy, Planet Modifier, that could be useful. Biolabs, I think it's going to be Biolabs actually. Uh, leaders, so room for two more, and I guess that's going to be two Governors. Just take the youngest. And the youngest. Right, uh, sector, you need a guy. And 20, so you need a guy as well, I guess. Excellent. System survey complete. Okay, where are you at? One all the way out at the end of this uh, arm, heading over here. Construction complete. Surface, what are we lacking here? We'll have an upgrade there at least. You build this thingy. Right, and one thing I should actually get going here is the spaceports, get them up to speed. Those that are not on, on planets where we're going to get uh, you know, gonna get our people dying off. So here, here, and here. Here, okay, another couple of months, and we should be fully upgrading this one also. System survey complete. All right, where are you at? You're there, I see. You go upgrade somewhere. Construction complete. Okay, food is not really a needed resource right now. Okay, um, mining drone base destroyed. So someone else has destroyed some base that we can't get to. Way up here, yeah. So jackpot it is. So someone else is moving into this territory here. These guys, those guys, yeah. Construction complete. I don't like this. We have to take you out, I guess. Ships upgraded. Secret drone. You will do um, assist research here. Right, well, this is the planet. We are still waiting to upgrade. Yep. Yeah. Excellent. Here. Research complete. Nestling chamber. Oh, that's the one we're colonizing. 
I see. Oh, I see. Cruise Russian Beyonds. Arm torpedoes and armor, and this is energy weapons damage, build speed auto cannons. I don't know, let's just get the uh, specialty resource. Right, two years until most of our population dies off. Of our conquered population, that is. System survey complete. Right, system anomaly survey found. done. Okay, I found an anomaly as well. The debris, the, the debris field, which is uh, 6467Q38, is part of rolls and swirls under the influence of unknown forces. You go and deal with that. You are here. This is still outside our borders, and this is, this is actually inside our borders. You go and survey this then. It used to be outside our borders, but this planet has pushed its borders. I imagine that's the case. Yeah, probably is. Right, so. Construction complete. Brutal. Spaceport. Actually, these guys first. Upgrade here. Build a mining network here. You get a power plant. You get a power plant. You get a mining network. You get a science lamp and you are growing and you should have 10 population, okay. Up is down. As the Hive Drone XV passes to the asteroid's belt on its way to uh, 6467Q38, Science Officer Autonomous Drone 16 reported that the ship experienced a number of sudden gravita gravitational shifts. Ever curious, Autonomous Drone 16 dispatched a number of probes to scan the debris field to discern its cause. It turns out that the culprit is a number of gravity generators old, of old alien make, sputtering and dying, um, sputtering on dying energy sources, and with their polarities inverted, they occupational spew reverse gravity into the void, though not with enough force to cause any serious harm, and not anymore. Science officer Autonomy Drones theorizes that the generators are once provided artificial gravity for a large asteroid in the belt, but some malfunction eventually tore the rock apart. Alright. System survey complete. Anomaly found. Right. Strong, uh, strong energy emissions from unknown origins makes this asteroid stand out from the rest of its peers in this crowded asteroid field. You go research that. Where are you? Oh, you are the one that's doing that research. I see. Oh, I see. Construction complete. Colony established. Okay, get back to you in a while. We will upgrade this one. All of that using fine. You build a spaceport. And then you are in a sector. Excellent. Right, can we now maybe get this going? No, not quite. Weapons target range. So it gives us two science. It's, the asteroid is pockmarked with craters from weapons blast and appears to have been used as a target range by someone roughly two millennia ago. Residual energy readings suggest they were tested incredibly exotic weaponry, including subspace bombs and some kind of singularity generator. Our scientists would be interested in studying the unusual energy echoes that remain. Right, our science ship here, you are done. So you go and survey, I don't know what, you have a lot of stuff to do up here actually. You head this way, no one seems to have been up here.
Situation log updated. Encounters. Um. Yeah, why are you not afraid of him? Are they not attacking you? I think they are. Just get out of here. Just get out of here. You are evasive. And investigate them. That's another thing we should do. Right, where are you gonna go next? This is not in our borders, but this is, so this is where we are going next. Maybe we will queue up a bit more. That should, should suffice for now. Okay, did our ship get out? It's not been attacked, so yeah, he did get out. Special project complete. All right. Crystalline entities is your special project to study them or take them apart. We will, our fleets will never get here before they're dead, so let's just Situation study them. Updated. Only takes a month. We should be fine then. Project complete. Okay, crystalline entities unbreakable. It's a long amount of text and it gives the sonar and spend 30 energy to instantly survey any crystalline entity system when entered. Okay, so I can send the guy back and just survey all the system instantaneously and get back out. Let's try that on for size. I don't think I've ever done that really. I just ignored that uh, event when it happened. I just, yeah, okay, that seemed dull and just moved on and waited for the guys to die and then We're surveyed the systems. Yeah. Right, research done. Automatic exploration. All right. Um, right. Colony ship is not essential. Shield capacitors would be nice. Antimatter reactor would be nice, resource, government ethics attraction doesn't matter, physics labs could be nice. So I think I'll take the physics labs. Uh, we have autonomous thingy. We can actually go somewhere. Where do we reach? Well, you reach out here at least. I see. These guys. You're down here. Yeah, you're not reaching anywhere though. All right. You go and do that then. System survey complete. That is these guys. Nothing for you to upgrade. And nothing for you to do. All right, let's head to the capital with you. That is here. And that's just research. But these guys happened to close their borders uh, while two of our ships were in the system. That's a bit annoying, really. And one was on the way out. The other one had a bit to survey. So the timing was just awful for that. Otherwise, we actually would have a lot of things to survey up here. Construction complete. Okay, what are we going to do with you? We're going to upgrade you, basically, and that is that for now. Research complete. All right, uh, found a resource. Well, have potentially potential for finding a resource, but not present, it looks like. Um, defense stations, not essential really. Better rail guns, not essential, but it could be useful. We're done going with the facilities, so let's just do the other one as well. 
So better labs all the way around. System survey complete. All right, where are you at? You're the one up here in the interesting bit that we still have room to explore. Actually, we were going to go here. No, we can't. Let's go here. And then instantly survey the thing as soon as we arrive. See if that works. Right, and then I spent... Spend, how do I do that? Um, crystal sonar. Well, that's free to have, so let's have that active. No. How do I spend them then? Where do I spend them from? This guy's unemployed. I guess he just stay unemployed for a while. Do I click the sign ship and maybe right click and say spend? Survey, then you will actually go around and survey everything. How do I instantly survey you? Hmm, how do I do that? Okay, allows us to order our fleet to use a special technique when encountering a crystalline entities, instantly serving the system they dwell in. Okay, so our fleet should do that. Is that our military fleet maybe? Rather than the science ships? That could be the thing. Just for run for a month. See if you actually have anything to do. You just cancel all of that. There's nothing here that seems obvious. Survey system. Oh, just survey planet. No, no. No, no. Okay. This did not work look like if we go to the military fleet would that have a survey thingy nope I don't know oh I don't know maybe when we enter the system while we have the edict active let's try that you are upgrading here, upgrading here. And you move down here and do a mining, no, a power plant. All right. Unrest, terror. After a period of mounting tension, the unrest on Thriving Green has resulted in a terrorist action. While casualties and property damage was minimal, faith in the Corellian organism's ability to protect the citizens has been shaken. Uh, I think, yeah, yeah, that's fine. No one's going to live there anyway. They're all going to die. Right, these guys, let's just try this once more. Move here. See what happens once we enter the system, and if nothing happens, then we'll just go and survey over here. Migration treaty, that's fine. Titanic life. Uh, the native life of nesting chambers built on an epic scale for larger than any one previously thought was possible for biological life. The question now in the minds of our researchers is, what is their secret and can we benefit from it? Proposals to study the native life in greater details are flooding in. No, we can't, well, we'll go with our hive mind here, no, no. Uh, 
uh, study them now, harvest them, and see if anything is useful. Situation updated. Let's just get in here, our system. There you go, crystal sonar, do it. Right, and then the system is fully surveyed. I see. Excellent. Uh, so we should have had the edict active before we actually entered the system. Fair enough. Research these guys for two months. And you can go away. Okay, they're back out again. Special project complete. Right. Titanic life study. Success. After, uh, okay, we're... Well, what planet is this on, by the way? After a period of research and study, the scientists on Nestling Chamber have managed to make a breakthrough and achieve limited communication with some of the Titans. While huge, slow, and difficult to talk to, the Titans are increasingly tough and strong. Some few have expressed desire to join our military forces, where they will undoubtedly be an incredible asset. Titanic beasts cannot be recruited here. But... Okay, but, 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 you know, they're not I've mind. Oh well, apparently you have some titanic beasts. Right, I will take a break here. Thank you very much for watching.